more and more magazines are doing that. I know. <laughs> yeah, I always, people say, can you do it for less? And I'm like, sure, call my landlord. If they'll take less this I month, have a I have to. <laughs> but I noticed more and more people. I even have my landlord <laughs> phone number on my computer, written down on a post-it. And the first time I did it, you know, the guy laughed at me, and I go, I'm not screwing, I'm, I'm telling you that if you call my landlord, and you can get two months' rent out of this, we have a deal. <laughs> and the guy goes, well, he's not going to do that. I said, of course he's not, but it's worth a try. <laughs> you know? But I think a lot of people, especially like photo interns, or right? like. But that's a different level. So when you're a photo but intern... But I think yeah. producers... No, but it goes back to what he said before. It's like, if, if you want that exposure and you think, you know what, a cover of Vice would be... You know, right, you have to decide. The, the problem is it's, it starts to become a race to the bottom. Right? I think more and more like, people are trying to... Yeah. And, and, but if you believe yeah. in what you're doing, and you're like, you know what, that is going to be a great photograph on Vice. And then you take that photo on Vice and you run with it, and you don't think that people are just going to discover you because you have that on Vice. You have to like then take out the megaphone and be like, oh, right. yeah. and then be like yeah. let's call her. She works for free. <laughs> <laughs> But the, there, there are publications that have uh, systematically got yes. done. I mean, there was a whole thing. Out magazine just got uh, right, sued yeah. for like a hundred thousand dollars in what? back payments that they didn't pay. Mm -hmm. Nylon, their entire career is nylon. about like mm -hmm. you know, interview nylon. magazine and Were nylon you? are famous for not paying. Yes, I have friends who yes. work. Yes. Mm -hmm. So. Yeah. I took Nylon to small claims court. Oh my God. Yeah. <laughs> they owed me four thousand dollars, and it was we had a contract that actually yeah. said. They were really, really bad. And they were like we, and so I kept calling because I was like I get paid, I just get paid. So they were like, you know, we owe we owe a lot of people a lot more money, and I was like, that's not my problem. <laughs> Wow. They, but again, they had three different accountants in six months, so that tells you where the magazine is at. Yeah. However, I went to small claims court. They never showed, so I won the case. Wow. I put a lien on every bank in New York City, and you know what? A Friday afternoon, I get a very angry phone call from, they were not going to make, uh, what do you call it? Uh, payroll. Payroll that day. And they're like, you've locked our bank account. And I was like, yes, I have. Wow. <laughs> oh my God. Yeah. I never worked for them again, but you know what? You it's gonna be paid. Okay. <laughs> no, I didn't. I was like, I'm over it. I'm, I'm and again, I never got any work from having pictures in nylon. 